A quick thinking dad had avoided a nasty encounter when he spotted a rattlesnake at an East County playground. A rattlesnake wranglers say with the rain gone, more snakes are out looking for food. CBS 8's Abby Black is working for you on how to protect yourself against those rattlesnakes. Rattlesnakes have no boundaries. One father found one here slithering through the playground in Santee. Rattlesnake wranglers say they are working overtime responding to calls. We're working for you on what you need to do if you spot a rattler. You can hear the rattling as this snake quickly slithers across the mulch at Big Rock Park in Santee. I filmed him. He wanted to go underneath it, but he couldn't make it, so he curled up in his uh, coil. Jeff Carver says he spotted the rattlesnake when he brought his five-year-old daughter to the park yesterday around four. Penny had already made it to the jungle gym, and I noticed this snake uh, slithering across the sidewalk headed towards the equipment. Jeff called the fire department. The kids had already hightailed it on top of this rock. You can hear their excitement when a new fireman was finally able to catch the snake. You hear him yell, he got him. We got on the phone with rattlesnake wrangler Alex Trejo. He's looking for him right now. He's Trejo knows a thing or two about rattlesnakes. So I've been catching them since I was a kid. No kidding. Yeah. Carver yeah. shares the video with Trejo to learn more about the rattler. Okay, that's a Southern Pacific rattlesnake. Southern Pacific. Yep. Southern Pacific rattlesnake. There you go. Yep. During the conversation, Speaking Trejo has to keep checking snakes. his phone. Is it, you're really busy right now, huh? Yes. Yes. Wow. We asked the wrangler why there are more rattlesnake calls so late in the season. But we had so much rain that it kind of pushed the season back further that when snakes normally would start coming out, it was raining during that time. Now the snakes are slithering through overgrown vegetation, and when it gets really hot, they'll find cooler spots. I always find them almost always under the lip out of the doorstep. Trejo recommends that if you spot a rattlesnake, call a wrangler like him who will safely relocate the snake to a remote area. You do not engage with a snake. So many men and people want to come out there and say, hey, let me just chop the head off. And what happens is that incident results into a bite. He recommends that if you are bitten, call for help and stay calm. He hopes people will have a better understanding that snakes are not menacing creatures. Sounds like you like these guys. I do. They're great. <laughs> I like snakes more than most people. I tell Working for you in Santee, I'm Abby Black, CBS 8. All right, but he knows what he's doing. Mm, at least. I mean, he's got the hat. He has to know what he's doing. <laughs> he looks like he knows what he's talking about when it comes to snakes.